Hello students, hello friends, welcome to Techno Science Club. In today's class, National Means Cup Merit Scholarship NMMS practice test number one in paper number two, Scholastic Achievement Test, subject biology, seventh class general science, chapter number one, nutrition in plants. In this chapter, some important bits are learned. Welcome back friends, welcome back to Techno Science Club. First question on your screen, NMMS practice test number one. Which of the following is nutrient? Protein, fat, vitamin, all the above. Your time starts now. For every bit, you have 10 seconds time. In this 10 seconds, you have to give the correct answer or guess the correct answer and write on the comment box. Very good. The answer for the question, all the above, protein, fat and vitamins are all called as a nutrients. Next question. Second question, human beings belongs to dash category. Which category? Human beings can be categorized as option A, heterotrophs, option B, autotrophs, option T, option C, parasites, option D, saprophytes. Your time starts now. Very good. Answer for the question, heterotrophs. Human beings belongs to heterotrophs. Question number three. The food making process in the plant is called DASH. Option A, glycolysis. Option B, photosynthesis. Option C, photolysis. Option D, chemosynthesis. Your time starts now. Very good. Answer for the question, photosynthesis. You know the plants are make their own food by the process of photosynthesis. Question number four. Which part of the plant is called its food factory? You know the plants are make their own food by the process of photosynthesis. So in which the photosynthesis processor takes place, in which part of the plant? Option A, fruit. Option B, seeds. Option C, leaves. Option D, flowers. Your time starts now. Very good. Answer for the question, leaves. In leaves, the photosynthesis is a happen and make the plant their own food. That is, leaves are called food factory of the plant. Question number five, tiny pores present on the surface of the leaves through which gases are exchanged occurs are called. Option A, stomata. Option B, grid cells. Option C, food holes. Option D, gas holes. Your time starts now. What are the tiny pores present on the surface of the leaves? through which the gases are exchanged. The tiny pores present on the leaf, surface of the leaf is stomata. Sixth question. What is the ultimate source of energy for all living beings, for all living organisms? Option A, water energy. Option B, wind energy. Option C, solar energy. Option D, chemical energy. Your time starts now. What is the ultimate source of energy for all living beings? Very good. Solar energy coming from sun is the ultimate energy for all living organisms. Question number seven. Green pigment present in the leaves is called Option A. Hemoglobin Option B. Globulin Option C. Albumin, option D, chlorophyll. Your time starts now. What is the green pigment present in the leaves? Very good. The green pigment present in the leaves is chlorophyll. 
chlorophyll next eighth question during photosynthesis plants take what gas release what gas in the photosynthesis process the plants are take some take a gas for the photosynthesis and by the photosynthesis some gas is released the plant take which glass and release which gas your time starts now option a take oxygen release carbon dioxide option b take carbon dioxide release oxygen option c carbon dioxide takes but not release oxygen option d take oxygen but not release carbon dioxide by the photosynthesis process plants take oxygen and releases sorry plants take carbon dioxide and release oxygen option b is the correct answer during photosynthesis what happens which energy is converted into which energy option a solar energy is converted into chemical energy option b solar energy is converted into mechanical energy option c chemical energy is converted into mechanical energy option d bio energy is converted into chemical energy in photosynthesis which energy is converted into which energy very good in photosynthesis solar energy is converted into chemical energy question number 10 raw materials for the photosynthesis are among the following which are the raw materials for the photosynthesis raw materials for the process of photosynthesis are very good carbon dioxide and water Question number eleven. End products of photosynthesis are by the photosynthesis process. Which products are come at the end of the reaction? End of the chemical reaction. Option A: carbon dioxide, carbohydrates, and oxygen. Option B: carbohydrates, hydrogen. Option C: carbohydrates, water vapors. Option D: carbohydrates, oxygen, and water vapors. which are the end products in photosynthesis process very good which are the end products in the photosynthesis process very good sorry the end products for the photosynthesis process is carbohydrates and oxygen question number 12 Which one of the following is parasite? A. Lichen. B. Cascuta. C. Pitcher plant. D. Rhizobium. Your time starts now. Parasite. Which is parasite among the following? Very good. The answer for the question. Cascuta. is the parasite question number 13 on your screen which of the following class of organisms belongs to saprophytes which of the following class of organisms belongs to saprophytes option a fungi option b algae option c lichens option d bryophyta saprophytes chindina 20 which organisms belongs to saprophytes the answer is fungi fungi belongs to saprophytes question number 14 on your screen which of the following is a pair of symbiotic organisms which of the following is the pair of symbiotic organisms
very good answer for the question option d a and b which is lichens rhizobium and ligaments rhizobium and uh, ligaments Option D is the correct answer for the fourteenth question. Both A and B is the correct answers. Last question, fifteenth question on your screen. Which of the following is an insectivorous plant? The plant takes some insects as food. option a pitcher plant option b indian telegraphic plant option c four o'clock plant option d cascata the answer is pitcher plant so among these 15 questions in nmms practice test number 1 how many marks you got in this test write on the comment below please like share and subscribe thank you thank you for watching we meet in the practice test number 2 thank you for watching jai hind vande mataram please like share and subscribe have a nice day